Hey, it's Mr. Peace. Just got done sharing my heart with St. Mary of the Hills in Rochester Hills, Michigan, but from my home here in Michigan. And it's always an honor to speak in my home state. This is where my heart is, you know, where I've lived my whole life. Uh, but the talk tonight was a very important topic. We focused on diversity, the need for human kindness, like the shirt says here. You can see the design with the peace sign inside the heart, and that's where peace has to begin. That's where peace starts. That's where the Prince of Peace resides, right? Christ Jesus and all of us, and that we can become an extension of him to push that kindness into this world. And it's so desperately needed, you know, in our country, in our world today, especially as it relates to showing someone that act of love, right? That it may not just affect that one person, it may actually change someone else's heart that just sees that kind act or hears that kind word, that it could positively touch their heart too. So we have to show that unconditional love. We talked about that tonight through a series of stories and video clips, uh, some songs as well. And the whole premise is this idea of unconditional love. Love without any conditions. That same love that our Father has for each of us, right? And if we can go out and show God's love, then we start to really, uh, you know, walk in that same path that Christ did and become his disciples and become his followers and then take that up a level to let that love that's inside all, all of our hearts start to burst out. And, you know, it goes back to 1 Corinthians that, you know, we're all part of this body of Christ. And if one of us suffers, if one person's hurting, then the entire body is hurting, right? But if we can show that kindness to one other person, then that entire body of Christ, the entire church, you know, feels that love too. And it becomes contagious that we want to keep showing others how much they are loved and how much they are worth. And that also ties back to our worth. Like the M on all of our palms, we all have the letter M. And that M stands for miracle, right? Upside down W for worthy. With the lines in each of our palms, we all have that letter M. And we need to believe that we are these beautiful miracles created in God's image and likeness as his children and then help others that maybe don't believe that or see that despite their differences, despite their diversity, which we talked about on the outside and on the inside. That we can still show that love and compassion, acceptance and empathy and inclusion. And, you know, in, in, in Isaiah 49, it says that I have engraved you on the palm of my hands. And this is the proof. We as Catholics, as Christians know this. And now it's up to us to go and be that change, you know, to be that miracle to someone else. As always, thank you so much for touching my heart. You guys are beautiful. And uh, it was just an honor to get to speak to all the students today at St. Mary of the Hills, S-Moth for short, right? And hopefully I get to see you all in person one day in the near future. But for now, and as always, make sure to hit the subscribe button you'll see pop up on the screen here. Check out my website, link to, to track my journey across this country. And don't forget to look at some other inspirational videos you'll see on the playlist over here. Much love. Christ, peace.